Hey, it's Wolf here. So in this video, I'm going to talk about how to diversify your portfolio. Okay. And first of all, I think that no one, if so, very few people in crypto really build portfolios. A lot of people just can't like find tokens that they buy, like, you know, gem tokens and stuff like that. That work, that can work if you, for example, if you just buy something very good in bear market and it goes up a lot. However, the only problem with that is that it's not good for long term because think about it, if you like have a portfolio where you have like 90% of uh, token X, okay? Two scenarios where this can go. So this is a 90%. Okay. Two scenarios where this can go is, uh, well, three actually. Okay, so the uh, be best case. Most likely, oh my god, I know. Most likely and uh, worst case. Okay. So, um, if you, for example, let's say you buy this token X, the best case scenario, it goes up 1000 X, but after it goes 1000 X, your portfolio looks like this it will say you're to you are 100% invested in token x all your money are token x even though you have made profits uh i will come back like well, well i will just explain it right now like if you make money like this way you make crazy money with one pick what happens is that first of all there's tons of cognitive biases so first of all if it goes from let's say you know it goes from ten dollars to hundred dollars Okay, during bull market, and then people are saying, "This is going to go to thousand dollars, baby. This is going to ten x again. Let's go. This is the best investment ever." And then you have all, but you have already made ten x there. So now you are like, "Okay, so I have already made ten x, but people are talking about that. I can see the potential here. I'm very emotional, very excited about this. I have made money. I can make even more money. Easy ten x again, um, bro. Uh, you know." If this goes thousand dollars now the problem with that is that that leads 99 percent of people don't take profits in bull markets because of that bias that i just talked about and also if you manage to take profits okay let's say that you sell all of your positions and you get out of the markets well this is the way that you got to reach so now maybe you in the next time you find a new token and you go again 90% in but this time it goes to like zero or 50% down or anything like that it goes it's, it's bad so then you lose all your money so either way if you make a lot of money fast with it or um you know like if you make a lot of money fast with it it's great but in the long term it, it, it uh, you 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 are still stuck with the one trick pony mentality and on the longer horizon it will freak you up, okay? It's very hard to, you know, because the incentive of doing that, what I just told you, is so high, so if a lot of people are going to do it, some people are smart and they are not going to do it, but it's, you know, it's still a habit, and Charlie and Warren Buffett talks about the chains of habits are too light to be felt and they're too strong to be broken, okay? And most likely is that it just stays the same. You know, you don't gain any money, you don't gain any... Uh, you don't have any losses, but the first of here, you don't gain any experience. You have all your eggs in one basket, so you just kind of like flows around there. And uh, if that happens, uh, either it goes down or it'll go to zero, or at end some point it will go to zero, or it goes up again to this the hundred, like it makes thousand x, but still. It, it comes with the bias, so at some point you will probably lose your money. <laughs> you know, you can see that best case goes to zero. The probability of going to zero is very high. A lot of people like will argue with me this one, but no, no, you can pick one and then you make money and then you start diversifying. Well, yeah, you can do that, but a lot of people don't do that because, you know, you did, you, it's same thing as like if you have $1,000 and then you get $100,000. 
you will have the same money habits when you get one hundred thousand dollars. Your money hab if you get money, your money habits doesn't change unless you change the money habits. And the best way to change the money habits is change before you actually get the money. You know, and I'm telling you this, and right now you might be no no wolf. You are just wrong. Well, maybe I'm wrong for you, but for me and everybody I have studied, this is hundred. This is what happens, and that's why, for example, lottery winners and you know pro athletes they lose all their money because they don't know how to handle it and that's why you need to build a portfolio and manage risk but anyway so let's i'm going to talk about that later in a second here but let's look at the worst case so worst case is well it goes to zero so right now if you didn't manage your portfolio didn't manage risk you went all in and didn't build the portfolio all of them lead to like like very bad results and that's the reason 99 percent of people don't make any money with crypto they don't manage the risk you have the, the only thing that separates you from the other ab animals out there that true apes who are just aping in everything is that if you can uh, manage risk that's the only thing that matters if you can that's the whole point of portfolio like now you will like people argue with me that, no no youtube this is a new asset class it's not even a new this is crypto is not even asset class by the way it's it's software um you know but you know hey 99 percent of people don't make money because they don't manage risk they can make short-term gains but this is up like if you're if you're looking at long term people will lose all their money so what you want to do i talk about this in a in the golden portfolio membership where actually build a solid portfolio i show you like what i'm buying every time what i'm buying and stuff like that it's insanely good no one else is doing this okay so you want to create diversified portfolio with basically um, high 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 well high risk let's just put it high risk high reward uh mid risk mid reward and low risk low reward basically you want to create like a diversified version because everything is probability you have risk and reward so you want to kind of balance out you want to have these kind of like a more of like a low risk ones and then like a little bit of these and then just a little bit of these and if these go up they will probably become like 50 percent of your portfolio if this for example like hundred thousand access they will become 50% of your portfolio and you should take profits at that point on the low low so this so these are low caps by the way low cap assets so low uh, market capitalization meaning that's it's underground stuff and then we have mid and then high high cap um so when you for example pull pull up 100 x or 1000 x with the low cap coin it will become like 50 percent of your portfolio you want to take quickly take profits there and put the profits on your high uh you know cap so low risk low reward uh, kind of like place so this is kind of like how you want to build your portfolio it can be more in-depth but i like to just keep it very simple um because see like you can scale simplicity if you are very very like so that's why for example helicopters come down because uh, there's so many moving parts like that's the reason there's so many moving parts. But like you can see it's on three parts here and we are building portfolio here so you know it's just like uh, very easy to understand and uh, yeah i like this like this mentality and when you're building building the portfolio by the way you don't want to acquire positions like with all your money don't blow your whole load by a little a little bit time like every time and then you know but i'm going to talk about that more in the golden portfolio membership if you want to learn more you can check out the first thing description follow there thank you so much for watching this video i hope that you learned something here no one talks about this stuff i like to talk about this stuff because i truly want to help you i don't care about like i don't want your money i you know if i can help you at some point you will give me money <laughs> you know so i don't really care like i hope that this free value helped you uh, and uh peace out Thank you so much.